Hey there, folks. John Nolan here with your PM update for Saturday's E-Edition of the Times Leader. An Anacoke man was under the influence of fentanyl when he crashed his Ford Explorer, killing a pedestrian on Main Street in Plymouth earlier this year. That's according to court records. Ed Lewis has that story for us. Wilkes-Barre Mayor George Brown presented his 2023 budget today. Jerry Lineout was there and has the details, including who might be getting a raise under that new plan. Fewer families these days are sitting down to dinner together, statistics from a recent source show. History columnist Tom Mooney puts this into perspective for us as he looks back at how the American home has changed since he was a young. And it's Friday, which means high school football in the area. Don't miss all the action in the E-Edition, and check in with our reporters on Twitter tonight for live updates as they happen. Watch for our weekly tweet telling you who to follow before game time. Just visit at TL News on Twitter to get those details. Remember, folks, if you're not already a subscriber, call 570-829-5000 or visit timesleader.com slash subscribe. Thanks for watching and have a great day.